Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Sam Tech and Vlogs. Today we are going to discuss whether you require a smartwatch or a fitness band and whether you should get one. So as we know the popularity of wearable and fitness trackers made by companies like Apple Garmin and also Fitbit have resulted in a multi-billion dollar industry that has boomed over the last few years. But are fitness trackers really helping us getting healthier? So before we proceed to the positives, let us first look at the drawbacks of having a fitness tracker. First is inaccurate results. It has happened over various times that I have also been a uh, victim of you know inaccurate results where I walked a few steps and it records more than required. So first is inaccurate steps. Second is loss of interest. So I have heard from many people that I've talked with, they have told that when they buy a fitness tracker, they are very enthusiastic, but over time they lose interest with the fitness tracker and the fitness bands. Third is obsession with numbers. So this is something quite close to me, very personal that over a period of time, whenever I used to go for running, jogging, or even to the gym, I used to have a fitness tracker with me, or you can say app on my phone. And sometimes if I used to not get that app or you can say not take my fitness tracker with me, I used to lose interest. It was all about counting the number of steps, calories, and I used to miss out on a few days just because I did not have a fitness band with me. So now, if you do not have a fitness band with you, there are certain alternatives to the fitness trackers, such as mobile health apps are there, your phones have got a pedometer so it can count the steps. Apart from that, it also can log your other activities as well as to what you eat, how much you walk. So we have various companies out there which are offering you fitness bands, such as uh, what you can say Fitbit Charge is there, Mi Band is there, Honor Band is there, Huawei is offering, apart from that Amazfit is there and Fast Track Reflex is also there. Apart from this, there are other companies like Apple who are giving Apple Watches and Samsung Gear Watches which are quite popular. But does it really justify your needs? That is what we are here for. Price of bands and watches can range about 1000 rupees to all the way up to a staggering 90,000 rupees. So I can go on and on, but the real question is, do you need it? Fitness trackers have a variety of different functions and some of them work better than the other. That is what you need to keep in your mind while you purchase it. First is, counts your steps. Second is, keep track of your calorie intake. Third is, it sends you messages. Another way of fitness trackers is that it will send you messages, whether it be your email, phone alert, text, and you can even you know reject calls through your fitness trackers and even keep up to date with the social media content so it also monitors your sleep apart from that it also measure other activities such as it has got a gyroscope in that right whether you're sitting whether you're standing or lying down it also has got a barometer to determine whether you know how many flights of stairs you have climbed and a tiny gps within it so which can track your location which is handy for recording your route through which you're going either running or through a bike. Apart from that, it is also nowadays since due to innovation of technology, watches have also become water resistant. So this is quite important if you're going for a swim. Apart from that, I've already spoken, you can do walking, cycling and swimming. Apart from that, you can also control your music and volume is there, which you can control directly from your fitness band or even from your smart watches, which is a good thing. It will also help you in checking your vital signs, right? You know, you want to check your heart rate while you're running on a treadmill or maybe you're walking, you just, or maybe you're just lying down. You just want to check your heart rate. That is also you can do. Another important fact is that you can train more effectively and efficiently if you have a fitness band on you. If you're trying to lose weight, a fitness tracker can show you when your heart rate is at the ideal zone for exercise. This can help you get more benefit out of your workout. If you are a serious athlete, a fitness tracker can track your speed and distance that you have traveled. It also measures progress towards your goals. If any of these numbers which I have told you what you know you do not want, you can keep, you know, keep these steps to improve it and the fitness tracker can help you and show you these numbers change over time. This can help you out and you know you can figure out whether these strategies work for you or not. So now coming to the main point that is why do people love these fitness trackers so much? Companies like I've already spoken, Apple, Garmin, Fitbit, 
you know they have been providing these watches and fitbit has been providing the watches since 2009 so why are these industries booming at the moment the main benefit most of them will tell you is that wearing these trackers motivate you right it motivates you to see numbers right we are very motivated by seeing numbers whenever we go out for a run we see you know 5000 steps completed 10000 steps completed it motivates us so whenever you set a goal or a target your watch will send you a achievement message it will send you a different kind of alerts that you have completed these steps in this duration of time the next day if you you know over achieve that target it will again send you a different kind of message so you get quite motivated okay apart from that fitness trackers are designed to encourage this kind of thinking okay which i've already told you about so what else you can do so i used to have a samsung galaxy note 3 through which i used to you know send and share my fitness details or you can say fitness routines with my friends and it was quite motivational so these trackers have a way you know to keep you motivated the real bottom line over here is whether a fitness tracker will improve your health will you work out more while wearing it will you eat better will you sleep better at night if a tracker can motivate you to make these positive changes when no other tool can i think it's a good buy i think it's worth it as you can see there are plenty of ways to keep track of your health without even wearing a fitness band or a smart watch but that doesn't mean there's no good reason to get one for many people this brings out their competitive instinct if wearing a fitness band truly motivates you to move on and do more or even helps you train harder it could be a good investment the question is whether you'll get enough benefit to outweigh the cost well i rest my case and now it's totally up to you whether to go for a fitness band or not so before i end this particular session let me say please do not forget to like and subscribe and share it with your friends and before i go i would also like to say i hope you have a wonderful day wherever you are